my chief analyst, William Brandt. Do you have a pen? Pardon me? A pen. Hmm. Ethan, what happened in the Kremlin? Chief analyst, you say? If you're implying that I made a bad call. European male. 50s, about 6 foot, 180 pounds. Blue eyes. Who is he? A crude drawing, but by your description, that could be Kurt Hendricks. 190 IQ. He served in Swedish Special Forces. Professor of Physics, Stockholm University. Specialist in nuclear endgame theory. Asked to resign. Well, because he's crazy. Cobalt. You have to alert the Kremlin that one of their strategists has a nuclear launch device. And one of his operatives has the codes to activate it. And what makes you say that? I saw him. Leaving the executive armory bag in hand. He set off that explosion to cover his tracks. It could be weeks before the Russians know what's missing. Unless we tell them. They won't listen to us. As far as the Russians are concerned, we just bombed the Kremlin. The tension between the United States and Russia hasn't been this high since the Cuban Missile Crisis. And the blame, right or wrong, points to IMF. The President has initiated Ghost Protocol. The entire IMF has been disavowed. So what happens now? Now I've been ordered to take you back to Washington where the DOD will label you as a rogue extremist and hang the Kremlin bombing on you and your team. Unless you were to escape somewhere between here and the airport, having uh, assaulted Mr. Brandt and me. Sir? You would then illegally scrounge whatever material you could from a backup supply cache that I've overlooked, the same cache where your team are waiting for further orders. Sir, you may want to re- You will then disappear, and this conversation never having taken place, uh, your intentions would be unclear. But if any one of your team is caught or killed, they will be branded terrorists out to incite global nuclear war. Your mission should you choose to accept it. Ethan, you are my best man. And I'm sorry it's come to this, after all the sacrifices you made. If we don't meet again, I just want you to know, I've always considered you a friend. Stay down! Drive! Drive! 